Morning everyone, welcome to today's Vlogtober vlog. We're at the hen house um, and I've been up for quite a while because the cockerel likes to wake up about, I would guess, about 10 to 6. I mean luckily we're early risers anyway so um, it's fine but we're just having some breakfast and as usual on our uh, little holidays we try to be a bit frugal so I made overnight oats when we were back home we've had some of those but because we're on holiday we thought we'd have a bit of toast and marmalade as well a little treat it was very comfortable sleeping in the hen house wasn't it how did you sleep Martin yeah, you know, um, quite a long trek to the toilet it seemed like it <laughs> <laughs> Although it's only about five metres. Exactly. I'm just waiting for the toast to pop up and then we're going to get dressed and that and head off out for the day. We're going to go to Morahabli today, down to the sort of harbour bit, I think, and have a look around and get lunch. Mind you, people with big houses, they probably have to walk further to the toilet. Well, that is true, actually. <laughs> <laughs> we're not used to it. But they probably don't have to go outside. No. <laughs> Toast's ready. I'm ready to go out. I'm just sitting in the little outside bathroom. I'm going to definitely try the bath later. The shower was really good. Um, yeah, we're going to head off to Morahable, but we've kind of had a bit of a slow morning for us anyway, and really made the most of sitting here and the little ducks been following us around. I can hear the chickens pecking around and some of them have got little babies. Um, and just being in amongst these trees and being out in nature, it's so lush, it's so grounding. I highly recommend this place, but we can't stay here all day. Well, we could if we wanted to, but we do like to go exploring and I want to get my steps in. So we're going to head off to the harbour at Morahable. There's a few old sailing ships moored up here. It's quite something with the mountain background or backdrop. And then you've got obviously the, the modern ferry to Gran Canary, I think that one goes to. There's lots of fish as well in the harbour. I like it here at the harbour, the port. We have been here before, but not for many years. As you just seen, we saw the rays, they're amazing. And we've just had a sort of little look through the door of the um, tortoise, not tortoise, turtle rescue place, uh, which says on the gate it's open on Thursdays from 10 till one. So that's something to do another time. Martin's just gone back to the car to get the flask so that we can have a cup of coffee. What we tend to do is if there's a nice cafe, then we'll have a coffee out. But if not, we, we just have it from our flask, which does keep the cost down. Although coffee is not expensive here, um, 
but yeah we, there's nothing open so we're going to have one from the flask after the coffee we had a walk up and over the top to look for some lunch there's lots of lovely little places right on the on the seafront but we decided to go down the back streets and there was lots of cafes actually it's bigger than I thought it was look at that sea colour isn't that divine I had another burger this time a chicken burger Martin had a burger we both had a coffee and it came with a tip to 15 euros That evening we decided to play cards, so we were playing rummy, and I think Martin won more times than me, which is annoying. And after that we just had a very simple dinner of mackerel and tomatoes on toast. I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you so much for watching and for your comments on the previous vlog. See you tomorrow. Bye!